Hey guys, Josh here. I hope you're doing well. Today we're going to be looking at something cool. I've got two cool browser extensions for you that you can use with Amazon. Now with Black Friday coming up and Christmas shopping coming up, you're likely to be doing a ton of shopping for yourself, kids, loved ones, etc. And there are going to be a ton of sales. Now on Amazon, there's a big problem. You don't often know if an item is worth what Amazon tells you it's worth, right? We've got stories of sellers messing around the prices and Black Friday deals not actually being Black Friday deals. So today I'm going to be showing you two cool extensions that would actually help with that. Let's dive right in. I'll just open up my computer over here. Now, um, the first extension is called Keeper, Amazon Price Tracker. You can install this on any browser, Chrome, Firefox, Safari. Now, what this extension does in a nutshell is it tracks the history, the price history of a particular product and lets you understand better if this is the best time to buy it or if there's likely to be a better sale later on. Now, why by this is sometimes for some products, you get better sales on that particular product at Black Friday as opposed to Christmas. And in some cases, it's the other way around where you're going to get that particular product much cheaper at Christmas time instead of Black Friday. So it's this, this software is really cool and also it allows you to understand if the software you're looking at, or, sorry, if the product you're trying to buy is an actual sale or a scam because again like I said many sellers do this where they hike the prices of their products just before a sale and then bring them back just above retail price so you think you're getting a discount when in essence you're paying more so <laughs> it, it's it's absolutely criminal but lots of people do it and this extension is going to help you counteract that by showing you the history the price history for that product you could toggle between the entire year the entire year or the entire lifespan of that product or the last three months or today or the last week. I'll show you this extension in action in a bit. Now, the second extension I've got for you today is the fake spot, fake Amazon reviews and eBay sellers. Now, it's a very long name, but trust me, you, you, you'd easily find it. Now, this particular extension is super cool because it allows you to ensure that the reviews on a particular product are as genuine as you can expect because lots of sellers on Amazon and eBay they try to bribe their buyers um, for, for five star reviews by offering them vouchers in exchange for good reviews by offering them for refunds in some cases and you know and I'll try buying re false reviews because there are certain services out there that do sell fake reviews they will actually come on your product and leave loads of you know ridiculous five star reviews that when you actually take the time to read them you'd notice they are there's something wrong here now this this extension saves you time and just scans and analyzes that particular product's reviews and lets you know by giving it a grade between a through to f a being the best f being the worst to understand if these reviews are genuine or dodgy so let's see how these extensions work in action now uh, I've, I've got this watch open which is uh, it, one of the deals of the day on Amazon for the Black Friday sale and it's currently the deal of day price is 122 pounds now the retail price Amazon tells me is 199 let's see if Amazon is lying to me or not shall we right so let's scroll over here and this is what you get using keeper so if you've got the keeper extension in, installed in your browser you get this cool chart right below the picture of the product you're trying to buy so it shows you the full history of that of the, of the price of the product now right away this already tells me that the normal price on, on amazon is 149 pounds so amazon is clearly deceiving me here by making me think that it's 199 pounds usually which isn't the case it's usually 149 pounds yes the deal of day price is still lesser than that which is 122 but again this begins to help you understand the games these sellers play because 40 the difference between 149 to 122 and 199 to 122 is a lot bigger so you think you're saving 77 pounds when in actual fact you're saving just over 20 pounds 
so yeah th this this is why this is helpful so that way you're sure that you're not being um, messed about so now we look at this and we can see right from august the first it's been 149 pounds it's been pretty steady in that 140 range so i'm going to click over on this place where it says year you can see that on my screen day week so you can so you can change the range so i can look at this year and i can see okay that's pretty consistent it's been about 140 pounds all year sometimes it rises and then falls but mostly 140 pounds um so i'll go back to my three month view and i can see over here that there was a lightning deal on this uh and i believe this was uh prime day yes this was during prime day uh early uh, mid october and it was also 122 pounds then which is consistent with what, what it is now. So if you really want this watch, then yeah, you can buy it at that price because then you know that this is the cheapest it has been all year and this is the cheapest is likely to be all year. So if you really want this product, then you can go ahead and buy it. But now I know I'm making an informed decision because there's some products that aren't actually sales. Now, the second uh, extension I told you about, which was Fix Sports Reviews Analysis, what it does is it puts a neat little um, widget over here at the top corner of your product that shows you whether or not the reviews are fake. Now you notice the stars are blue. Now the normal Amazon stars are yellow. The fake spot stars are blue. So anytime you see those blue stars, that's showing you the the um, the, the the real rating as it were so this extension would scan the views of that product and try to tell you what the real rating should be like minus all the false and dodgy reviews so if a particular product is actually a one star product and it's got loads of fake five star reviews you'd see a blue one star and that helps you a lot let's see if we can find an example of this yes so you can see this you've got two blue stars and if you go into the product this is perfect guys you can see this you've got five stars five stars but over here it's two stars now of course this is another thing i wanted to speak about on this particular extension where you can reanalyze your reviews if you it, it will tell you if it's an older analysis so let's let's trust the process and reanalyze and see if anything changes reanalyze it's analyzing and we're waiting it's retrieving the product data and it's done ah boom so it's actually an a <laughs> fantastic so yeah this 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 shows you that previously the reviews weren't that good but now the reviews are much better so yeah what can i say fantastic fantastic i'm, I'm pleased with that um so yeah uh, that's that's fake spot review guys it's fantastic it helps you identify your know, potential products so you can see that's nice and updated now there's something i forgot to show you on keeper so i'll just come back to that real quick now on keeper there's there are additional things you can do you can track products um if you make an account you can track product uh sorry let me just cancel this <laughs> you can track product uh there i'll just refresh real quick that i just completely broke that because i chose not to create an account because <laughs> i really don't want to have additional accounts if i'm being honest um, but you can track products if you're if you're really interested in the particular product you can track it and uh give keeper such sort of your your baselines for um amazon's price uh, or you know third-party sellers or used prices if you're if you don't mind uh, getting it used and, it, and you can track it so when it hits that price it will let you know so fantastic i mean amazing stuff right it would, it, would, it would send you an email or push notification whatever you've chosen so it's it's amazing guys absolutely amazing and um you can also track across multiple countries which is probably the coolest thing about this extension so one thing i like to do sometimes is when i'm looking for specific products especially um, items that are more more expensive you know like 100 pounds and above 200 pounds 500 pounds that sort of thing like you know those big ticket items that you tend to buy just once once in a few years or once ever <laughs> right and you want to get the truly best deal 
on that item now this is useful because it allows you to compare across all the various amazon locations as you can see here you can see all the prices across europe the uk germany france italy spain and of course across asia in japan india um, and north america as well america <laughs> America, Canada, and Mexico. And you can see the prices. So now, just looking at this, I can really tell that it's cheapest in the UK because it's 122 pounds. Now, what is cool about this is a customer in the UK who really wants this watch could use Kipo, could use Kipa, I beg your pardon, to check this and then come buy it from the UK shop. Because if it's 225 pounds in the UK, in, in the US, at almost half that, it it actually is worth buying it from the UK because the shipping cost would be much less than buying it brand new from the US. So this is very cool, guys. So if you've got big items you'd like to buy for Black Friday or Christmas, Amazon has got the logistics. They will get your product to you, believe me. <laughs> they, they can deliver anything to any part of the world. Um, and yeah, you can use this for Christmas shopping, Black Friday shopping. And um, I'm sure you guys love that, guys. I love I, I love these extensions. I use them all the time. I, I've saved a ton of money, a ton of money on Amazon by buying particular products at specific times because I can check the history. So what I do is how I use this uh, software, these extensions, is I initially I find the product I like on Amazon, and then I check the ratings, the reviews. I use the fake spot extension to make sure that the reviews actually are genuine and that the product is a safe product to buy. Once I have ascertained that, the next thing is to check the price history. Now, I do this for one of two reasons. Number one, to be sure that there won't be better sales on that later on in the year because sometimes some products are super cheap in January and expensive later on in the year and vice versa. Some products are super cheap on Black Friday and not as cheap on Christmas while some are cheaper at Christmas than at Black Friday. So you have, to, you have to kind of play that game. And it helps you understand if you're better off waiting a few months to buy the same product because it's going to drop in, in October or drop in July or whatever it is. And more importantly, it helps me understand if a particular product is actually on sale because so many of these sellers play fraudulent games, they hike their prices right before a sale and you're not actually sure if you're getting a good deal. So this is super useful on Black Friday. You can use this to make sure that you're getting the best prices possible on the products you're interested in. Anyway, guys, that's been it. Let me know if you like this video. Give us a thumbs up if you really loved it and subscribe for more videos like this. I make videos about everything tech related as long as I think it'll be useful for you because I'm I kind of like to live on the edge tech wise. So I'm always looking at looking for all those cutting edge things and super useful things that I can actually integrate into your day-to-day -day lives so yeah please guys if you love this video let me know in the comment section below and smash the like button and i'll catch you next time till then as usual be fantastic peace mm -hmm.